a special shout out to all my awesome YouTube members and patrons Riptide, Anik D, Matthew Hall, Sheldon Kelly, Yoshika Bay, Madlo, Lucky Charm, Sam Medina, and Billionaire Overlord for their amazing support. Hey guys, and welcome back to Sydney's Today, we are the Walkers mod. So, um, I think we quickly need to make ourselves some grenades again. We have a ton of these, and we I think we should have enough resources to actually make ourselves a ton of HD grenades. Um, now, I don't know how uh, worth it's going to be, because we already have so many explosives. Uh, as you guys can see over here for the Horde Knight, we have a ton. Um, I just hope we can actually finish the Horde base before Horde Knight, but that's a different story. Um, okay, what I need to do right now... You grab some forged iron. I think that's what we're going to run out of at the moment, because we don't have that much. Yep, there you go. Uh, we need mechanical parts and springs, right? Let's, let's see if I actually remember this uh, correctly. Mechanical parts... Springs are over here. Uh, springs, springs, springs. And I think that was it. Let me see if I was right or not. Um, we're going to do... I think it's over here that we have to make it. Grenade. HD contact grenade. It says 40... Uh, I don't think it's that one that we're supposed to make it in. Grenade. If I'm not mistaken, these grenades are like instant they, they, that they craft. Yeah, look at that, instant. This thing is just way too OP at the moment. Okay, so now we have explosives. I'm gonna use these to kill the demolishers. So we're gonna mostly use these ones over here to use as a chaining method. And then... I think, I think we'll chain these. We have so many pie bombs over here, normal grenades. We'll use these to chain them. And then when, once we see like demolishers and stuff, then we have to use these to chain those. Um, yeah, man, I am really not looking forward to the next order because I have just no idea whether they're going to be able to survive. Okay, let's see. I need to put this away. Uh, lock 10 slots. 9 slots, put that there, and then put this away. But yeah, um, we actually have quite a bit to do still, guys. I wanted to put traps and stuff in there. But we won't have time, so I'm going to have to make use of uh, spikes and all that stuff to hopefully get ourselves a base done. We'll just quickly jump up here. Jump up here. Okay, so we have a ton of stuff still crafting. It's a shame it's not done yet. I wanted to go build, but I'm not sure. We have to wait for these to finish anyways. So I think what we're going to do is while we wait for these to all craft, we're going to go looting. But I don't want to take a massive undertaking at this stage. Like, for example, um, I, I don't want to go on from over here or be south. Okay, next and right, we can actually take away. Next and right. Okay, next and down and then south. Um, but we've already done this row here, so I think let's do this row on this side. And then it's nice and close to the base so we can get back and get the resources when we need it. Uh, where have I done and not done yet? That's the problem. I think we have... I think we've done this side. I will go check. Um, if we've done the side, that's awesome. If not, then obviously we have something to do while we wait for the resources to finish. Let's quickly really go down, and let's go. Before the ladies is up, I want to say before the ladies decide to jump, I want to get out of here. And then you're oof in the background. But guys, we have so much that we have to do. Uh, at least we have like 300 steel blocks, so we should be able to get everything done in time. But I'm still not sure whether we're able to do it or not. I'm going to be cutting it really, really, really close. I think the shooting range we've already done. Let me just make sure of this. Yeah, I think I ranged the cars last time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We've definitely done this one. We've ranged the cars and everything as well. I think I, I thought we didn't do this yet. And then I checked inside and we were like, it's all empty. Now, Jericho Farm on this side. I think we've done this one for a quest, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, empty. Empty and untouched. Okay, so we have not done this one yet. I'm starting to get more crowbars, but crappy crowbars, not the best crowbars. Okay, what's that here? We've definitely not done this one before because, as you guys can see, there's still stuff in here. Move, 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 move. What are you guys shooting? Oh, hello. I was about to say, there's nothing there but the shooting, 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 and yep, there was something there. Oh yeah, that goes down, and there's a floor that caves in over here, I think. Yeah, that caves down. I don't want to fall in down there now. I think that goes to, like, a water system. 
We need to go down there to get the rest of the stuff, but I think we should be able to clear this place from over here. Ooh, two screamers, damn. Three screamers. The house of screamers. Whoops. My aiming definitely needs some work. But guys, we finally got our second last pistol book. I should probably stop doing that. Just now we actually get a bookcase or a ton of books that might have gotten in it. But yeah, we have our second last pistol book. Now we just need the last one. As soon as we find that last pistol book, we'll be able to go and combine all the 9 mil ammo. And it's going to give us so much more space to work with. Like an insane amount of space. Okay, um... Yeah, there's this room over here. I think all the final stashes and stuff are downstairs. Please move. Please move. Please move. There you go. Okay. I want to make sure we've done everything on this side first. I think this is the garage. No, it's not. It just leads outside. We came from the garage. Yep. Okay, so now we need to go down the hatch. Where is that? It's over here, right? Yeah. We need to go down here. It's going to be safer going down this way. And just falling in. That's very unsafe. I think you can actually you can actually fall into the water first, but I wouldn't recommend it. What's in here? Wait, this can't be it, right? You fall in. Where's the final stash? You can swim here, but that's about it. You fall down here, you walk back here, you fall down here, you walk up here, and then you go up the stairs, right? Am I missing something right now? It feels like the final stash is right here, but I'm just not seeing it. There is an upstairs. We've already been upstairs, though. See, that just falls down into the water pit again. There's no point in going down. You have to go up. Let me just see where have I... Oh, yeah, ladder. I was about to say, damn. That just didn't make sense just now. Hello? Oh, no, 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 you don't. This is definitely a house of screamers. Damn. How many screamers have we seen just now? That's easily like five or six screamers just now in this one place alone. Damn. Okay. Um. Hopefully we get a ton of these places. And then, guys, the biggest reason why I'm going for these now, you know we have to wait for the stuff to finish crafting. But we do need that last uh, book, pistol book. If we can find that last pistol book, we'll be able to then take all our 9 ammo across to the base as well. To take three stacks of ammo with us, or three boxes worth, it's just not feasible. Okay, I think we've done that one already, so we need to go down to these over here. My bike is this side. It's nice when everything's made out of wood. It makes it so much easier just getting stuff done. We've definitely been to the left already because I remember there was a quest that we had to do there. Gas station to the right. What is to the left? It's the barn. Oh, this barn also sometimes has stuff inside, I think. It's been a while since I've actually seen this one, though. It has resources, though, so that's good. Um, it has a box hidden over here. Yep. Construction box, there you go. And then... Zombies up top. The NPCs can deal with the zombies for me. It's nice when we get a ton of resources like this. We are going to need the cement anyways later because we need to make a base on top of a ward base. So everything needs to be concrete and steel and just all the way upgraded and stuff. Damn. Okay, well, the crucible's not bad. The crucible's super expensive to make. And to buy. So to get it like that, it's not that bad. Uh, my drone is with me. Let me just quickly... Ooh. I oh, know. You see, inventory, I just accidentally said to it, keep quiet, hush. Okay, um, yeah, if we get full stacks and stuff, we'll put it in there for now. I need to constantly make sure we have space on us, though. So, when I can scrap stuff, I scrap stuff. If I can't scrap, then I can't scrap it. I'm only going to lock nine slots. There you go, and let's go. Okay, this one, you can actually kill the dog. I think we've already done this one. There's supposed to be a dog over here. Okay, let me just quickly try this. I think we've already done this PI. I hope that's empty. There's no point in doing this PI again if it's empty. See, the nice thing is so many of these PIs we have done early game, that now we don't have to do that many when we're busy over here. What is this? Just the park, which means there are going to be some sleeper zombies. It 
it's nice when you all, all you have to do is shoot in one spot, more or less, and you can hit all of the zombies. Make one of them fall down and then get for them from there. Okay, um, we're going to get this one from the front, so let's keep on going. And we have a farm to the right of here. Hello, hello, hello. I want to jump because I know there are sleepers and stuff in between of here. Oh, crap. Hello. Spider's done. The problem is in a field like this, you can't see what's going on. Where are you guys? I can't tell whether they're shooting at something or not. Because as you guys know, these NPCs fire at anything and everything. Okay, I need to kill animals. 200 and something. I'm not even going to skin them right now because that's not what I need them for. I just need them for the kill quest, for the kill counter. Okay, and then we have to go inside. Yeah, we only need the resources and then we need the final stash. That's all I'm here for. There is a room at the back, so there should be some zombies in there too. There's almost always a zombie over here as well. Or not this time. Okay, cool. While you guys deal with the zombies, I can quickly deal with this over here. And you open the door, of course. Sometimes I close the door to keep myself safe and then they end up destroying the door and <laughs> putting me in danger where they're supposed to keep me safe. Okay, I think they ran out of Whoa, that gave me 80 forged iron just now. Because our wrenching skills maxed. Um, I was about to say, I think we ran out of forged iron when we were busy making our stuff just now. But as long as we have more forged iron, we'll be able to make more HD grenades. I should be able to jump this, right? Look at this. Okay. I'm all the way up here for the final stash. I have hops, people. I have hops. Wait, I feel like there was a chest or something broken over here. No, no, no. This is still here at least. Come on, give me that pistol book. HD Iron Breaker. Nice. Wait, don't I already have that? There's a bear down there. Hello. Oh, come on. I wanted to kill it. I need the kill quest for all the animals, so I need to kill as many as possible. Okay, at least there's no zombies waiting for us over here, so the more we can get done right now, the better. I'm just really hoping we get that last pistol book really, really soon. Because, guys, we're going to need it. And I can't emphasize enough how much I need that book. And my luck so far has just been horrendous. Okay, this one has the HD Iron Break on. Um, and then this one's supposed to... Yeah, has it on as well. HD Iron Breaker should be able to go on over here as well. So we can take that off for once and put that on there because it's meant for iron. This one can now go on my guns and stuff. Nice. And I think... Oh no, we already had one on. I was about to say, oh, I think we can actually put it on that one. That would have been cool. Okay, so we're just going to keep on turning. I should probably go for that over there. But we're just going to keep on going for the houses for now. It's really close by. It's not that much of a hassle to quickly go for it, so we'll quickly go for those. Okay, come ladies. Comes to Papa. Okay, so this one on the left is a dangerous one. Have we done this one? I know we've done a similar one, but I don't know if it was this one or not. There's books in this one, so it's important. Although they have changed a bit, so it might not have the books I need. Please. Oh, we haven't been here yet. Nice. The one we were in the first time had a zombie there, but not here. Please, 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 bookcases. I am making... I'm really, really begging you right now. I need it. What are you guys firing at? Sometimes I don't see when there's a zombie left, and I'm like, what the hell? If I'm not mistaken, at the back over here is a... What do you call it? A pool with, like, a bear and stuff in, right? So I should probably go kill them first, but let's just first go up. Oh, hello. That just gave me a fright. Where the hell did you come from? I should probably make sure I close all the doors behind me, but they're going to open it anyways. There's no real point in closing doors if they're just going to open it up there for the zombies. Okay, move, 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 move. No, 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 that's rude. Wait for them to come to us first. Oopsie. I keep getting jump scared by zombies. 
Okay, no zombies, no zombies, nothing with cards. I need bones and stuff as well, that's why I'm trying to go for it. If I had an explosive, I could actually go for that over there. As long as the bear doesn't come up here. Yeah. Oh no, there's no bear this time. Sometimes there is, sometimes there isn't, it seems. So are you going to be able to deal with that dude, or do I need help? Because this shotgun doesn't have a uh, real range. This shotgun's insanely powerful, but look at that, that's the max range. If it was in a certain amount of uh, distance, then all of a sudden I can do insane damage. But as soon as it gets a little bit too far away, all of a sudden there's zero damage. Please, I need that pistol book. Imagine I finally get that pistol book now, after I've been waiting so long. Last episode, we got one, and this episode. Please, 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 please. I swear, if you destroy a bookcase right now, lady, they love firing at zombies that are not even visible. Okay, food and drink. Oh wow, the bear's actually coming up. Hey, where's the bear? I knew there was a bear. I just couldn't see. I was like, oh, okay, so this time they don't have, they don't have a bear. Come on, please, I need that pistol book. So far we've seen pistol or other kinds of books, like the uh, books that we've already had. Okay, oh crap. But we haven't seen a single pistol book we've had so far. I hope I didn't jinx myself now, I need the one that I don't have. Okay, yep, hello. Okay, come through, come through, ooh crap. Stand on row, stand on row, stand on row, stand on row. I need to shoot like hip level or lower. I want to say D level. <laughs> um, to make sure that I hit all the zombies properly. Especially if there's a spider. I don't want him breaking my legs right now. But I don't want to break the blocks that I need to as well. So I need to be careful. What the hell are you guys still firing at? All the zombies should be gone because of Feral Sense being on. No, 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 no. I need this. Thank you. Are oh, there still zombies that haven't woken up yet? That's the question right now. They're still firing shots, so I'm guessing there's a zombie or two that's just woken up. Unless they're firing at zombies finally that are outside and not inside. Come on, give me what I want, give me what I want. Unbox. Not bad. The more parts we have, the more we'll be able to do later as well. As you guys are aware, we need to be able to make ourselves a ton of weapons. Um, we should have all the parts, it's just the duct tape we need. I think we have an... I know, I, I used up all the steel for the horde base. But we even had enough steel, we just couldn't use it. Okay, um, let's do this, 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 make some space. That can go on a weapon, and this can go on a weapon. So if we have a weapon, a pistol or something, we'll be able to put both of those on there. Nope, we don't. Uh, do we have a helmet piece? Also, no. Anything that could have a mod just doesn't have a chance right now. Okay, we don't really need the pipes, but let's just grab it as well. I mean, this is the reason why I have so many pipes at the base. What are you firing at right now? Hello? You must be a wandering horde or the zombies outside or something, because otherwise they wouldn't fire like this. It has to be something on the outside. Okay, we can do this, we can drink this, we can go... Yeah, I hear, I hear something beating on something. Oh, it's a wolf. Okay. Next up is this PI. Please move. Thank you. Uh, can I get out of here? Yeah, yeah, we can. I think I looted everything there, right? As far as I could see, I definitely looted everything. Oh, this is an underground farm place. Been a while since I've actually seen this one. Hello. Make them come to us. Because when they're standing in a straight line, all you have to do is fire once. I need the kills though. I don't want the zombies getting the kills. Or the NPCs, I mean. Yeah, yeah, I know the zombies up top. We should have gotten all the zombies down here though, so we don't have to worry about getting cornered. But the NPCs are going to start firing a lot because they just TP'd upstairs. 
Got two of them just TP upstairs. It must be nice having that power, being an NPC. Oh, hello. You guys just call zombies to us. I keep thinking this nurse is a zombie. Every time I see the nurse run at me, I, just, I keep firing. Or I start firing. Okay, when we see apples, we need to grab apples. Later we can maybe do the food quest, then we're going to need apples for that. What are you firing at? Oh, there you go. Oh, there's a bookcase over here, isn't there? Yes, there is. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Every time I see a bookcase, my hope I get my hopes up. And then all of it, uh, it always turns out to be nothing. Okay, so let's go through here first. Nothing. Please move. Go through here. See, they had all the chance to kill him just now, but they didn't. So messed up. Okay, I need to just go up and then deal with the zombies upstairs. Let them come to the door. Ah, these NPCs are going to interfere with me soon. Nice. And I think I have the radiation gun on me right now, well, mod on me as well, right? The red mod. So, I should be able to stop the regen before they come for me. Okay, please give me something cool. Give me something awesome. Nope. Uh, this one's hitbox is sometimes messed up. You have to see it say farm sealed loot or farm sealed loot, whatever it's called. You have to see that name before you try and hit it. Otherwise, you hit through the block the whole time. Damn it. Okay, so unfortunately, it's a bust for this one as well. We need to do these two and then move down to this side. Oh, well. I was a little bit further jump than I thought. Oh, hello. I thought you guys were the NPCs just now. I keep confusing zombies for NPCs and NPCs for zombies. Okay, so we have to turn around the corner and then we have to turn back to this side. Um, because I want to make sure all the outskirt buildings are looted together. Obviously all the city buildings are looted together as well. I keep forgetting to turn this on. If you have this light on, it's so much easier to see where, what you're doing. Uh, what's in here? Oh wow, that was accidental, I was able to destroy it just now. Okay, nothing that I wanted, and we're supposed to go in at the bottom of here. I did not kill her, but they're gonna kill her, right? No, they didn't. A lot of times they just knock the zombies down and that's it. They could have easily killed that zombie just now. We don't need any more oil, so I'm just gonna leave that one for now. There's bound to be bookcases over here, so I need to be careful. I do not want to accidentally end up destroying my own bookcase in a possible schematic. Okay, I'm gonna need my drone soon because I'm getting full again, damn it. Okay, so this is a kitchen area, there's a book over here as well. Come on. So the one if you see that outside. There you go. Now we can go upstairs, right? And there's a garage over here as well. Usually a few zombies, one or two. What the hell? Oh, there you are. I was wondering not just now where the vomit sound is coming. Oh, hello. What are you? What's this? Look at this. Field shipping ground. I never realized this was here. Imagine they give us a lost one. Oh, that would be so awesome. There you go. Now you can kill it. Right? There you go. Okay, so yeah, um, I didn't realize there was something up there, but there was a final stash, or secret stash in there. Not a final, it was a just a secret one. Okay, there's a cop in there, or... Yeah, one of these dudes. When you hear the wound sound, it sounds like a cop wanting to vomit. Did a 
Wolf actually get, managed to get in. What the hell? I didn't even see this one sleep in the corner. Damn. Okay, drone. While they're protecting me in this room, or rather blocking me into this room, let's just see if we can't make ourselves a little bit of space over here. Armor. Put these away. Put a stack away. Technically, we could just put some of these on some of these things, but I don't have the time right now. Okay. We should have enough space to do a little bit more with. What the hell are you firing at? Oh, might be a wandering horde because what the hell is going on now? There's definitely zombies outside trying to get in. We'll leave that for now. So we already went there. This is just oil. I'm really gonna be mad at myself if I accidentally end up destroying loot. Okay, ladies, please move. Thank you. What's over here? Just a bag and cardboard. Twine. We don't really need twine like this. Move. Move. Thank you. Oh, there's gonna be a zombie to the front over there as well. Hello. Oh, usually there's a zombie over here. That's why I thought it was gonna be a zombie. Here. Nice, okay. Yeah, you need to move. You need to move. Thank you. Okay, the zombies usually turn around the corner over here, although I struggle to turn the corner. Hello. Oh, there's a prop. Oh, that one just fell to the floor. Oh, I'm glad I didn't run out of ammo just now. I was very close to a reload. Come on, there's a radiant zombie down there. Get her. You can't tell me you, you can't handle one old little lady. Probably try and go back and quickly see if I can't make some more ammo. We should have enough automatic parts by now, right? We are going to keep the guns and stuff with us anyways, if uh, so, just in case we need it. Okay, so now we need to go across the road over there. This way. To make sure there's no bears and stuff here. Every now and then they hear like a grunting noise like it's coming from a bear or something. Okay, sometimes there are snakes coiled up over here, so we need to be careful of that. We go through here, and then we just keep on following this path. Okay, and there's usually zombies over here as well. Yep. I really am not a fan of how they can just TP in front of you. Because I've gotten so many, so many times I've gotten jump scared by these ones. Okay, there's sometimes a zombie around the corner and up there. Fighter just woke up over there. Oh, guys, these ones used to be... They, they weren't always the screamer. The spider zombies were always the screamers, so now they're Tom Clarks. I can't remember why they changed it again, because the, the long, lanky dudes... They, uh, they actually looked like spiders. They can't pull... Oh no, they were screamers, I mean. Okay, we need to go upstairs and not fall down, please. They were spider zombies, but they were also screamer zombies. Every time they scream, they call their buddies uh, to them. Okay, give me this, give me this, come on. Oh, this place. Just shoot, head height. Or bum heights, or whatever heights. Hello. Oh, I swear, if I had to reload at the last second and he destroyed all the loot of you, I would have been so mad at myself. I should always, always, always make sure that I am ready for anything. So, I reload before I go into a final room. I knew this was going to be the final room. Man, I need pistol books. The trader might actually have, you know what? The trader might actually have the pistol book. So, we just finished this one off. Which means we need to go next and south. Boom. Okay, so. Oh, next and down. So we need to go uh, south from over here. We need to go down from over there. And we need to still move do all of these over here. We have so many buildings we still need to do. Okay, what we could do is quickly go try and find those things on the map. Uh, but I really also want to check the trader where he has those books for us. 
He might have reset already, and that's going to be a good thing for us. Hello, hello, Wolfie. The problem is, as soon as I do this, I need to make sure I'm the one that kills the, uh, the wolf. But every now and then, they manage to kill the wolf. Just as I jump off the bike, the wolf's already dead. It makes it really hard for me to get the accomplishment if they kill all of those ones. Which means I can only kill, like, the domesticated, non-threatening ones like bunnies and chickens and stuff. And pigs. But the pigs are also so fast, by the time you jump off your vehicle, they're gone. Even the bear, sometimes they hit the bear right in the face, and it's an insta-kill. Okay, there's a bear over here. You guys just protect me, please. Okay, we do this, we check, it's that side. I'm gonna do this as fast as possible, so we check where it is, and then we dig down on it. I'm touched. What is this? Tungsten spear. What I need is the tungsten crowbar. Or the other crowbar, the... What's it called again? Legendary. I need the legendary crowbar. I don't know why I forgot what the name was called. I'm actually thinking of getting myself a few... Oh, hello. Oh, they killed the pig because I accidentally hit it. Um, I should probably give myself also a few melee ladies. So that they don't have to fire the gun so much. But do you know how long it's going to take to clear up your eye if the ladies only have melee instead of guns? I almost see this like a radar, as like a radar trick. They actually need to uh, introduce something into the game as like a radar for treasure. I mean, X used to mark the spot, now it doesn't anymore. But is this a fetch quest? No, this is just a treasure, right? So there shouldn't be zombies spawning for this. Wait, where am I supposed to? Did I dig the wrong way just now? I'm supposed to be more or less level with the treasure right now. But I'm right on top of it, or it's either going to be right underneath me, or right above me. And Officer Burns is in the way, so I keep accidentally hitting her as well. Okay, this backfired. Being able to see more or less where it's going to be. Um. Oh, there you go. Wow, this one was deep, actually. Usually it's only like three or four blocks down, but this one was super deep down. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There you go. Oh, wow. This is actually a good chest. A ton of ammo, guns. This is actually a really good chest. Although, as you guys can see, we are completely encumbered now. I'm just scrapping a ton of stuff to make space so we can grab all the important stuff. Let me cross. This is challenge search and find. I have done this. Tier 4 clear. I haven't even found one of these yet. So this is the first time I've seen these. Okay, now we need to get out, but you have blocked the way. Uh, I know, we just jump out of here. But guys, I'm just going to call it episode here. If you guys like this episode, leave a like and share with your friends. Comments and tips of feedback, leave it down below. And if you guys are new to this channel, leave me to the subscribe button for more of this content. See you guys next time as we hopefully finish our horde base before the horde starts. Because you only have like 12 in-game hours and then we are screwed. Once again, a huge thank you to all my members and patrons for your support. To join them in supporting the channel, please click join or the Patreon link in the description down below.